Now, for the hundreds of thousands of Australians who suffer from needle phobias, a trip to the dentist can be torture. Well, there's a new product which is promising to make the experience as pain-free as possible. This product is fast, effective and painless. Anything that encourages people to go to the dentist has got to be a good thing. A needle phobic's nightmare. That dreaded dental checkup. That's it. Not anymore. A new product promises to take the sting out of a visit to the dentist. There is no needle and there is not even a hidden needle. So um, people are afraid of needles, which is a lot of people. Some have really big phobia from needles. Uh, they just don't have to, uh, to be afraid anymore. Developed in Europe, Injex, a needle-free anaesthetic, is now available to dentists here. Dr Sagal Jacobson is among the first in Australia to use it on her patients. Usually they say, that's it? Am I numb? I say, yes. Are you sure it's enough? I say, yes, let's just wait. And they're shocked. They, they, all of them, they're like, wow, that's, that's amazing. Open up this. Self-confessed needle phobe Katie Drager is trying it for the first time. How are you feeling? Yes, good. Uh, starting to go a little bit numb now, so yes, it's all right. As someone who doesn't like having needles, do you think this is something you'd consider having again? Yes, it was so much better than having a needle because you didn't have the feel, feel the sharp pain of any needles going in. You just really heard the, the little tug of the push button. So, how does it work? The spring-loaded injector is placed against the gum and triggered, shooting the anaesthetic through at high pressure. It numbs the area just like a traditional injection, but without a needle. Psychologist Sandy Ray says needle phobia can be debilitating. Hot flushes, cold flushes, feeling like they're going to have a heart attack very high sensitivity to pain. I mean, it's a huge source of release for these people because they're not going to be suffering the anxiety and the anticipation of pain that they normally would in view of getting any sort of medical procedure or a dental procedure for them. I think it would cut a little MO box down here. Associate Professor Matt Hopcraft from the Australian Dental Association welcomes the innovation but needs to see more evidence before it takes off. It certainly seems like it's something that's very interesting and something that we should look at a little bit further. The device's use isn't limited to dental patients. Skin cancer physician Dr Mark Frank is also using it at his Melbourne clinic. Skin cancer particularly occurs in exposed areas such as the face and um, they come in here and they're very, very anxious about having needles in their nose or in their lip. Now over here there's no needle mm -hmm. on it, okay? So right. what I'm going to do is I'm just going to push this on your back. Okay, one, two, three. It's used to numb the area around a mole or cancer to be removed relatively painlessly. Did you feel anything, Don? No. Just like maybe somebody clicking you, you know. Not the sharp prick of like an injection. And uh, what can we do for you today? It's also growing in popularity among cosmetic patients using Botox in place of the anaesthetic. How was that? Great. <laughs> <laughs> they are astounded. They really are. It's a fantastic product. It can also be used to administer vaccines and insulin to diabetics. It's certainly a wonderful process that now is available to the public, which is fabulous for people who are suffering from that phobia. I don't think it's going to replace needles altogether, but it will serve a, um, a very important purpose for those who have uh, needle phobias or for those who need to have procedures and particularly sensitive sites.